One. Keep your hands up. Two. Relax, relax, relax. Sorry. Slowly, slowly. No problem, no problem. You, it, I don't know. It, it's okay. It's very normal. It's just, just it's just some, control it. It's just okay. something new. And you never been taught then you can cook. So for you, the moment you don't feel me, you feel yeah. you're gonna fall. Hi guys, welcome to another episode of Swim to Fly. Today I'm with Violeta, which is a, a friend and beginner for swimming lesson. I hear that you want to learn how to swim. Yes, it's been my dream for many years. Your dream for many years. How many years have you been dreaming about swimming? <laughs> At least five. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so can you tell me a little bit what you can do in the water? Have you tried before? I tried, I even took some classes. I have some of the movements, but I don't feel comfortable fully with my head on the water. Okay, so you don't like to put your face inside the water? You feel like pressure, you feel not comfortable? Yeah. Okay, yeah. so we have an amazing swimming pool here. We are in Singapore. First thing is maybe I'm gonna try to see what you can already do right. and then from there we'll try to improve, okay? All right, uh, let's go, let's jump in. Uh, okay, show me what you know. But you are a pro. No. You don't need my help anymore. I can't breathe <laughs> any I can't do more than this because I can't breathe. I know. What you do is you maintain your head on the surface yeah. and you pretty much move forward with arms and legs. It's very hard to keep your head on the surface of the water. What you need to try to do is maybe learn how to blow inside the water. Yes. Do you know how to put your head inside? I tried. Let's try again. You take a deep breath, you inhale, and then you blow with your mouth or with your nose inside the water for as long as you need. And then after you stop, only one time. Okay, so which one is better, with the mouth or with the nose? Uh, I would say I prefer the nose, the nose. Okay. excel with the nose, but if you don't feel comfortable, just blow with your mouth and blow. One, two, three. It's very important to blow slowly for five seconds if you can. So take a deep breath and blow. You okay? Okay. I think the main issue is the control of the breathing. Yeah. So this control of the breathing is the priority. In swimming, if you don't learn to swim, you need to learn how to breathe. Yeah. Uh, we can practice with no being at the middle of the pool, just right here. Okay. So one exercise you can do is take a deep breath. <gasps> exhale with your mouth, five seconds. I will show you first and you try to do the same. You see, I blow, but I never stop my blowing. Okay. If you stop, the water might come inside. Okay. That's uncomfortable usually. So take your time and we count together. Okay. If you don't feel good at any time, you just exit the water, okay? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Take a deep breath and go. One, two, three, four, get out. You okay? Yeah, better. That's very good. All right, that's it. Maybe that's I need it. to be more calm. Maybe. Yes, you need to. Because it's very stressful for people who are not used to it. Yeah. Okay, you need to control your emotion. It's if you know what to do, it feels like it's walking. It's so easy for me. But for someone which is trying to learn, it feels very oppressive. You know, very scary. Yeah. So let's continue. Let's go. One, two, three, four, five. Take a deep breath and repeat. One, two, three, four, five. You okay? Yeah. One more time. One, two, three, four, and five. How you feel? Good. Okay, maybe because you hold the wall and everything is under control, <laughs> it's easier in the psychology level, yeah. you know? Okay, now we try to go deeper. So you have goggles on your eyes that will allow you to open your eyes in yeah. the water and see clearly what's happening down. So you want to exhale, mm -hmm. put your eyes, your nose and your mouth in the water. So your whole face is inside, but you can keep your ear outside so you can hear my instructions. Okay. And we do the same thing. I will put my hand on the water and count for you. Okay. One, two, three, four, five. Sorry. Relax. It's all right. <laughs> Just relax. I open my nose, I think. <laughs> Your nose always is open actually. What you need to do is not... I inhale. Not, yeah. Either way you inhale or either way you stop. Exhale. Okay. Okay. And that's usually um, no good. Okay. 
I recommend you to just blow. When you have no more air, then you exit the water, you breathe. Okay. Okay? And take it. You can hold the water, it's fine. Hold the water, it's good. Take a deep breath and go when you want. One, two, three, four, five. Excellent. Get up. No, no problem, right? Yeah. Yeah. So the key is exhale continuously, relaxed, and slowly. All right. We try again. Face inside when you want. One, two, three, four, five. That's very good. All right? Yeah. All right. That's the step one. So when you learn how to swim, you need to learn how to exhale five seconds. Mm -hmm. Okay, and relax. Now let's say, let's assume you check the box. You relax, can blow five seconds. The next step is be able to feel you can float and float in the water in the same time when, when you're doing this skill. So you actually exhale five seconds and at the same time floating five seconds. Okay. Um, do you know how to float? <laughs> <laughs> okay. I <laughs> <laughs> okay, the thing is, if you are in the water, without moving anything, being flat face inside the water, your body is not going to sink. You are going to float. I heard that. Yes. You heard, but you don't know about it. <laughs> but I don't <laughs> You're not sure about it. Okay, so maybe uh, come where there is the ladder. Okay. What you're going to do is try to hold the ladder with your hands. At the same time, then you blow five seconds, okay? You let your body float behind you. Mm -hmm. Keep your time. One, two... Are you okay? <laughs> I'm sorry. Okay, okay, no problem. It's fine. So what we're gonna do is something simple. I will make you from here. Okay, we move back. Here you touch the ground. Yeah. It's safe everywhere. Okay. Here you touch the ladder with your hands. So what we do is we look in the water and we are walking until you touch the ladder under water. Stop. You reach the ladder. That's fine? Yeah. Okay, well, very good. We do one more time. Okay. One, two, three, four, five. And that was super good. Alright? Now, you don't need to walk. What you're going to do is you're going to hold my hand mm -hmm. and I will drive you. Your legs are just going to... Don't move. Look at your breath. One, two, three, very good. That e excellent. Now I see when you hold me, she's yeah. squeezing me like this. You know, she's holding me. Like, yes. Relax your hands. Just hold smooth. Relax. One, two, three, four, five. That's very good. That's very good. You okay? Yeah. Ah, okay. So now we do the same a little bit further. Same. We go five seconds on it. Take a breath. One, two. That was pretty cool, right? Right. Okay, now my arm, I will put under your arm and your hands are free. So what you're going to do, you're going to do the same, but then at the end, you're going to grab the ladder. Put your breath. One, two, three, four. That's good. You're right. That's cool, right? Yeah. All right, let's continue. This takes some time, actually. I feel you're very tense. Up. That means, that means, I mean, it's fine. You're learning. That means you afraid of being left alone yeah. if you are horizontal. Maybe because you don't know yet how much you can float. So we will repeat this until you feel more comfortable. Okay? I'm not going to teach you butterfly. To, I, 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 I want to be clear. I'm not going to teach her butterfly now. Okay? It's going to be later. <laughs> okay, we continue to do. I call this fly. Okay? You learn how to fly pretty much. Okay? Open your arms and this fly. All right, very good. Okay, now what you do, it's a very normal reaction, okay? You're, you're floating, but not fully because you use your hand to pull down, to touch me under. Okay? Yeah. My hand is here, you, you make sure you feel me. So what I want you to do is try to open your arms and raise your arms, like op open your wings pretty much. Keep your hands near to the surface. If my hand is going deep, don't follow my hand, just keep your hands up. Okay. And then at the end you will not even touch my arm. I will still hold you from your stomach so you will be fine. Okay? okay. We'll do it until you feel you completely. Okay. Slowly. Okay. One, 
keep your hands up. Mm. Relax, relax, relax. I'm sorry. Slowly, slowly. No problem, no problem. You, it, I don't know. <laughs> it, it's okay. It's very normal. It's just, just it's just some, control it. It's just something new. And you never been taught, then you can cook. So for you, the moment you don't feel me, you feel yeah. you're gonna fall. It's not happening, but Let's try we, try, we try many times, Let's it's fine. Sorry. I'll hold you one hand only. Take your time, take your time. I can feel time. it. I can feel the floating. Okay, let's do it again. You have to focus. Okay, what you need to focus on is the breathing. Focus on the sound. One, two. That is for you, your safety thing is exhale. Exhale is safe. Exhale five seconds. Okay? Exhale five seconds. Whatever does your body underwater, you still exhale five seconds. Okay. That's it. You see? You see? Just focus on the exhale. The rest, the fact that you start to feel like, oh, the balance is weak, you're floating a bit, but then you're still not comfortable. That's, you were learning this. But the exhale, you control. This is the only thing you fully control. So control your exhale five seconds. One more time. Exhale. One, two, three, four, five. See? Okay, so instead of saying my one, two, three, four, five, because it's always repeating, it's boring, mm -hmm. I will say, Violeta is your name. So I'm gonna say, my name is Violeta. And then I will keep doing that, that kind of uh, singing tone for you to enjoy my tone. And I'm gonna sing, sing for you, different things. Okay. Making life Guys, ready? thank you for watching. Don't forget to download Swim to Fly app. We have many tips for everyone to learn. Stay tuned for more videos coming in the channel.